What's up, flamethrowers? It is me, Flame the Dragon Hog, here, and I am just hanging out with my three, with my, um, six very good friends. Well, not really good, well, not really. Some of them are, well, two of them are still evil, but one is good. But anyway, as we all know, today is Amy Rose and Metal Sonic's birthday. So, I'm here just hanging out with them, and I'm out taking them to dinner, yet again. Of course, uh, Metal Sonic, since he doesn't have a, uh, mouth, I, uh, uh, I'm just, yeah, he's just here. But anyway, let me introduce everybody. First up, we have, in the little red dress, we have Classic Amy. Hello! <laughs> and over here, in the white dress, we have my version of Amy, or Modern Amy. And over here in the other red dress with her hair up, <laughs> it's Boom Amy. Why, hello. <laughs> it's really good to see you ladies. And looking sharp, I'm glad you guys were able to dress to impress. Yeah, also, Flame, I heard about what happened with you meeting your future self. Oh, yeah. Well, just so you know, Flame, I really do hope you don't end up evil. Don't worry, I promise you, uh, I won't end up evil, but if, it, but if I do, you guys better be prepared. But anyway, moving, anyway, moving swiftly along, we have here Classic Metal Sonic. Oh yeah, I forgot, Classic Son, oh yeah, I forgot, Metal Sonic didn't talk back then when he was in his classic form. Shoot, I forgot. But anyway, um... Anyway, next up we have, um, modern, uh, Metal Sonic, which is my version, who's also very, who's also nice, actually. Greetings, everyone. It's very nice to meet you again. Flame, it's been a long time. Yeah, I know it's been a long time, I know. So, how's everything over at the Mobian Hotel? Absolutely exquisite. Great. I'm really happy. But anyway, and, and coming on to, and making his first debut onto the channel, it is Boom Metal Sonic. So, uh, hey, uh, Boom Metal Sonic, it's, uh, good to see you, I guess. It's not good to see you, Flame the Dragon Hog. I have yet to destroy you. Not so fast, Boom Me. You will not lay a metal claw on my friend. How pathetic of you, modern me. Don't you see you are protecting the enemy? No, Dr. Eggman is the real enemy. Don't forget about all the times he rejected us. Threw us in the trash heap. And no matter how many upgrades he gives us, he always calls us his most pathetic hedgehog destroying machine. I never knew that. Well, he has with me. Well, okay, well, before this ends up as a robot war, modern versus boom. <laughs> Well, anyway, um, guys, I'm glad to meet, well, guys, I am glad that you guys are celebrating your birthday. So, um, Amy's, um, quick question, uh, did the Sonics ever do something for your birthday yet? Um, well, classic, well, classic Amy, you can start. What did your Sonic do for your birthday? Oh, well, he actually gave me something very beautiful. In fact, I'm actually wearing it right now. Oh, is that a necklace that you're wearing? Yes. And look at this, it's a little locket. And inside is a picture of when we first met. When Metal, when Metal Sonic kidnapped you and he saved you on Little Planet. Yep, that's it. <sighs> Those were very good memories. Yeah, I know. What about you, Amy? I mean, I mean, modern Amy. I know that my, I know that my brother really does spoil you when it comes to your birthday. Oh yes, he absolutely does spoil me. 
because, you know, I am the queen of Mobius after all. But anyway, um, yes, he did actually get me very something very expensive for my birth for my birthday. And well, <laughs> it's back at the house right now, but <laughs> let's just say uh what he got me was something that's really, really nice. In fact, um tomorrow I think I might wear it for your flamethrowers to see. Well, okay then. After all, I was thinking about making a part two of a truth or dare that we did. Oh, well that's cool. Okay, and as f and what about you, Boom Amy? Uh, what did uh, Boom Sonic get you for your birthday? Well, he absolutely already gave me something very special, which is the little bundle of joy that's developing inside me right now. Oh yeah, how is your baby anyway? Oh, she's doing just fine. Great. When's she due? Oh, she'll be due in about a few months. Okay, good. Well, anyway, um, back to your gift. What did he give you? Oh, he absolutely gave me something very, very special. <sighs> I still can't believe it. He actually gave me that. Okay, what is it? He gave me a scrapbook of all the special events that we ever had. From the first time we faced off against Eggman, from our date, to all sorts of other things. And, most importantly, our wedding. It was beautiful. Well, I'm glad that you liked it. I'm glad that you liked it. Yeah. You know, on behalf of all the Amys, I'm pretty sure we're very lucky to be married to the most romantic hedgehog in all of the Sonic franchise. Hey, what about me? I'm pretty romantic. Well, Flame, we know that you are romantic. I mean, I'm just saying, our Sonics are really romantic as well. I mean, come on. You practically spoil everybody else. Well, yeah, I mean, come on. I'm the king. I mean, am I not supposed to spoil people? Well, yes, you can do that, but it just gets a little bit crazy. Okay, okay, I'll probably dial it back on the spoiling. I just want everybody to have a nice time, okay? I understand that. Okay, well, anyway, well, anyway, um... So, Metal Sonic, I understand that, so, Modern Metal Sonic, I understand that, you know, for your birthday, you used to hang out with the doctor, but since this is your first birthday without the doctor, what are you going to do? Well, I don't really know. This is my first ever birthday party, because most people don't really pay any attention to my birthday because I am a Sonic villain, and what person would pay attention to a villain? Well, yeah, that's true. Most people don't really care about villains, but in this case, I care. Because you're not a villain anymore. You're a good guy. Well, except for your boom and classic self. They're still villains, and the only reason why I brought them here is because, hey, if it wasn't for, I mean, hey, to be honest, if it wasn't for Classic Amy and Classic Metal Sonic, all the rest of you guys wouldn't be here. Yeah, I mean, think about it. We were the start of the franchise. And Classic, and classic Metal Sonic is still quiet. <laughs> I mean, I keep forgetting that he can't talk. But anyway, yeah, um, so yeah, guys. I really am glad to uh, spend time with you guys. So, um, and besides, um, Matt, and besides, Amy's, I really, I really do appreciate, um, you know, spending time with you guys because it's very so. I mean, we you guys rarely get to, um, you know, spend time with each other because, you know, with the separate timelines and stuff. I mean, the classic, modern, and boom era, we barely get to hang out with each other. Well, yes, that's because we all are busy. I mean, don't forget, I'm the queen of Mobius. I have a lot of important jobs that need to be taken care of. And as for me, I'm a freedom fighter. I have to protect my... I have to protect Green Hill Zone. And as for me, well, <laughs> I'm just a wife, a housewife, a mother-to-be, and also a really great fighter. Well, yeah, I know. By the way, um, by the way, Boom Amy, you really do need to be careful because... I'm pretty sure Boom Sonic doesn't want anything to happen to you while you have a baby bump. Well, don't worry. Well, don't worry. Everything will be just fine. 
Yeah, same thing for my wife. She already has a baby bump, and she's already out here, like, still fighting and stuff. <sighs> I really do hope little Flair is okay. Don't worry, Flame. I'm sure she'll take... I'm sure she's taking good care of the baby. Yeah, I hope so, too. But, you know, there is... But, you know, there is a question gnawing at the back of my head about Flair. You know how I'm a dragon hog and uh, Sarah's a bunny, right? Yeah. And, you know, our first child that we have is um, Amber, which is, a comp which is a hybrid of me and Sarah, right? Yeah. Well, the big question is, is Flair going to be a bunny, a dragon hog, or another hybrid? Hmm, that is a good question. I really don't know what it is. Well, maybe you can ask your flamethrowers. Yeah. Hey, flamethrowers, what do you guys think? What do you guys think? Put down in the comment section if you guys think that Flair is going to be a bunny, a dragon hog, or a hybrid. Or, you know, a crossbreed or whichever one. Crossbreed, cross, crossbreed, hybrid, whatever. But anyway, um, so yeah, back to the dinner. Um, you know, it's just kind of crazy. So, classic Metal Sonic, um, I know that it's been a long time since we last saw you. I mean, we haven't seen you since, uh, you know, Sonic Generations. And I do, and <laughs> the, and classic Sonic, you know, kicking your butt and stuff. But, hey, look at the bright side. At least, at least, um, you know, I didn't forget your birthday, right? Okay, he's still not talking. I mean, I gotta keep, rem I, gotta, I mean, I gotta remember... In the classic era, he can't talk. Okay, but anyway, um, boom, boom Metal Sonic, I'm just saying, like, the way you really went on trying to fight, um, Boom Sonic, and not to mention the rest of the gang during, uh, Rise of Lyric, I mean, come on, what the world were you thinking? And I thought you were, and plus not to mention, um, why in the world did you let him mind control you? I mean, I thought your software was, you know, I thought your software was to override any sort of mind control. That is affirmative, but my software was so outdated. <sighs> Stupid doctor. Wow, even you're hating your version of Eggman. Well, now that I think about it, all he ever did was, you know, throw me in the scrap heap and work more on his, his, um, other minions. Oh yeah, you know, the Slicers, the B-Bots, the, uh, Moto Bugs. <laughs> you know, I really, you know, I really do admire the, um, modern. I really do, and I mean, I really do enjoy the, uh, you know, the Boom Universe versions of the, uh, classic Eggman robots. You know, the Moto Bugs, the Buzz Bombers, a.k.a. the uh, B-Bots, and not to mention the Slicers. They are really interesting. I really do like them. <laughs> I mean, and by the way, those little crab robots, um, I forgot what they were called. I think they were called crab, crab meats. Yeah, crab meats. I think that's what they were called, crab meats. But anyway, they are, anyway, they do seem pretty cool, I guess. I do. I, they, they do seem pretty cool. And also, I really did like how they used, um, the, uh, the same things during Sonic Generations and stuff. That was actually pretty cool. But anyway, but wait, wait, no, Sonic Generations. I must say Sonic Lost World. I'm sorry. I'm getting the games mixed up. Speaking of Sonic Lost World, um, guys, um, this has been coming on to me for a very, very long time. Especially to the Amy's here. Um, ladies, um, I got some bad news I gotta tell you, um... I did a Google video with the, uh, Zeddy, also known as Xena. You mean that green Zeddy? Yeah, her. Why in the world would you do that? Well, Boom Amy, she, um, came to my house. She came to my house and she, um... Well, she came to my house and she wanted to look at Google with me. She wanted to look at Google and by the end of the video, she, um, told me that she didn't want to be part of the Deadly Six anymore. She wanted... She wanted to, um... She wanted to be good again. She wanted to be good. Hmm. Well... 
I don't know. I mean, we're lucky that all the other Antis and stuff were once evil, and, you know, they're turning good. And same thing with Metal Sonic over here. But how do we know that Xena won't, you know, reverse into her evil self again? I don't know. That's why we're giving her the benefit of the doubt. And if we, and if she does try anything, I'll be at the ready. I'll be ready to go ghost. Oh yeah, congratulations on your new ghost form. Thanks. <laughs> I did a lot of dimension hopping to get to, uh, Am, 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 I forgot the name of the, I forgot the name of the place. Uh, what was it again? Oh yeah, Amity Park. It took me a long time to finally get there. Hey, maybe I ought to bring some Danny Phantom characters onto the channel. I mean, I'm pretty sure there are still some people out there who remember Danny Phantom and some of the characters. Hey, flamethrowers, let me know in the comments section if you guys want me to bring some Danny Phantom characters onto the channel. And, and I was thinking about doing a date or pass with some of them. I was thinking about it. But anyway, but anyway, back to the dinner. Um, so how is everything? Hmm, everything is delicious. Yeah, I absolutely love my burger. <laughs> you were always a big fan of a burger, huh, Classic Amy? Yeah, I'm not really much into chili dogs. That is, not yet, until you, you know, want to impress Sonic. Yeah, modern me, I know. But I used to love, I used to love burgers. I mean, I still do, don't get me wrong, but, um, I really don't like chili dogs all that much. I mean, not as much as Sonic. <laughs> yeah, my brother, he always packs in his chili dogs. But you know, there is this one question that has been rattling at the back of some people's heads. How in the world can Sonic eat so many chili dogs and he still remains slim and trim? I mean, I know he runs really fast and he burns all those calories and stuff, but I'm really surprised. I'm really surprised. Yes, I mean... All versions of Sonic, even though they are, you know, even though they have an amazing appetite for chili dogs, they do seem to, you know, burn off all of them. <laughs> yeah. Although, my version of Sonic doesn't really eat chili dogs all that much. He always loves to eat burgers from Matt Burger. Yeah, I know. By the way, how's Dave the Intern doing? Eh, a loser as usual. <laughs> Yeah. Well, anyway. Oh, hey. Um. Oh, hey. By the way. Um. Boom, Amy. Are we still on for <clears throat> casino night over at Casino Zone? Oh yeah. You know it. Oh, be sure to bring Sarah. Oh, don't worry. I'm pretty sure that Sarah will love Casino Zone. I mean, we haven't been there in a very long time. Uh, don't worry. I'll also be sure to bring the gang as well. Well, except for you know. Yeah. Except for Knuckles, cause, cause, if I remember correctly, last time we were at Casino Zone, Boom Knuckles got confused at the fruit and the slot machine, and he thought they were real, so he punched them. Ah, oh, Boom Knuckles, what to do with you? Well, yeah, <laughs> unlike his classic and modern counterparts, um, Boom Knuckles, he's a, he's a special case, but we still love him, right? Yes, absolutely. We all still love Knuckles. I mean, who doesn't love Knuckles? <laughs> oh, boy. By the way, I had Boom Rouge onto the channel a few days ago during her birthday. So tell me, how is she doing? Oh, well, she's doing just fine. In fact, she's asking about you. Me? What does she want with me? Oh, she just wants to know when's the next time she's going to be coming onto the channel. Oh boy, last time Rouge told me that, she tried to take my Chaos Emerald. Chaos Emerald? Yeah, don't you know? Each of my Dragon Hog friends have a Chaos Emerald. Each of my Dragon Hog friends have a Chaos Emerald. And each Chaos Emerald actually have an elemental ability. You never knew that? No, I didn't. I mean, don't get me wrong. The Chaos Emeralds, they do exist in the classic universe. But they don't in the boom. Yeah, but anyway, that is pretty cool. So, um, what type of elemental abilities do they have? Well, the red Chaos Emerald has fire abilities, just like me. The dark blue Chaos Emerald has water abilities, 
The yellow Chaos Emerald has lightning abilities. The purple Chaos Emerald has psychic abilities. The light blue Chaos Emerald has, um, excuse me. The light blue Chaos Emerald has ice abilities. The green Chaos Emerald has plant growing abilities. And of course, the white Chaos Emerald has, excuse me, the white Chaos Emerald has powers of the universe. It's actually pretty cool. Wow, I never knew that. Well, yeah, and get this. My version of Sonic actually managed to harness the, those powers. It's pretty cool. <laughs> but anyway, yeah. <sighs> but I still don't know why um, Boom Rouge wants the Chaos Emeralds. Hmm, I don't know. It's best if you watch your back. Don't worry, I will. Oh, snap, look at the time. It's almost 8.45. Well, ladies, Metal Sonic, I'm glad you guys enjoyed your birthday, and I'm glad I can treat you to this. Aw, oh, well, Flame, I'm glad that you get to treat us like this. Of course, of course. I mean, you guys are my good friends, and Amy, you're a very special sister-in-law to me. Aw, thank you, Flame. Oh, and also, I heard about what you're going to be doing to help my family. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh. You talked, let me guess, you talked to Roxy, didn't you? Yes, she's my sister. Of course I'm going to be talking to her. But anyway, I heard you're going to be going to the Lost Isle to see if you can try and rescue my other sister and Leia. Yeah, I'm going to be doing that alongside um, Rocky. <sighs> it's going to be a tough journey, but we can do this. We can do this. All right. Okay, well, well, flamethrowers. Looks like we reached the end of this video, so guys, be sure to put down happy birthday to both Amy Rose and Metal Sonic. And also, as I said, and also said a couple of times, let me know in the comment section, um, what do you, got, what do you guys think of me bringing Danny Phantom characters onto the channel? Yeah, let me know. And also, let me, and also... Um, I kind of forgot my other thing. Uh, I forgot my other thing on what I said. Dang it. Uh, but anyway, yeah. So, um, guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like and comment down below. And like I said, be sure to wish happy and be sure to tell classic, be sure to tell classic, classic Amy and classic metal, um, modern Amy and modern metal and boom Amy and boom metal. Uh, um, happy birthday, and also, let me know in the comment section below, guys, if you guys want me to show you guys, um, Casino Night, uh, with me and the Boom Cast, because I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys really want to see that, <laughs> but anyway, yes, um, Amy's, um, Boom, I mean, classic, I mean, pfft, sorry, so, Amy's and Metals, is there anything else you'd like to say before we head on out? All I have to say is thank you all so much for wishing us happy birthday. And maybe during the next Sonic game, whenever that will come out, we'll be in it. Because I know in Sonic Colors Ultimate, we're not in it. But it's okay. And as for me, I am very appreciated that you guys are paying attention to me during my birthday. I am very happy. <laughs> well, Metal, I am glad that you that you feel warm and fuzzy inside. No, that is my instant gear heater. I accidentally activated it. Oh, <laughs> sorry, Metal. But anyway, okay, let's head on out, guys. I already paid for dinner. <laughs> Cost me a grip, though. But it's worth it having you guys here. But anyway, I guess this is Flame the Dragon Hog. Classic Amy. Modern Amy. Boom Amy. Modern Metal Sonic. Boom Metal Sonic. And of course, I'm speaking for a classic Sonic. I mean, classic Metal Sonic. <laughs> and anyway, signing out for now. Later, flamethrowers, and happy birthday to Amy and Metal Sonic.